handful of religious leaders from across the state standing in a familiar place, just feet from the governor's office Thursday, calling on him to spare a death row inmate's life. Governor McMaster and South Carolina state legislators, if none of my previous words have spoken to your hearts, I ask you to reflect on this simple question, which is on the buttons of some of us that are standing here today. Who would Jesus execute? Religious leaders with the group South Carolinians for Alternatives to the Death Penalty gathered at the State House to urge Governor McMaster to stop, quote, killing people who have killed people. We look at Jesus as our savior and recognize that he himself was an innocent victim of capital punishment. As of right now, death row inmate Richard Moore is set to be executed November 1st and has until October 18th to choose whether he will die by lethal injection, firing squad, or electric chair. Moore was convicted of killing store clerk James Mahoney during a robbery where he went into a Spartanburg County store unarmed and the two ended up in a shootout after Moore was able to take one of Mahoney's guns. Moore was wounded while Mahoney died from a bullet to the chest. Stop pursuing executions. Our state has executed 283 people since 1912. While death penalty opponents continue to rally, supporters including former solicitor and Senator Greg Hembree say the death penalty is a necessary component of the state's justice system and urges people to look at the specific details of a crime. However, in Richard Moore's case, even former South Carolina Supreme Court Justice Kay Earn wrote in a dissent that Moore committed a spur of the moment killing, which is different from the usual brutal murders they execute people for in the state. Moore is also appealing the U.S. Supreme Court to stop his execution. As with last month's execution, the governor is expected to honor tradition and review the case and make his decision on whether to grant clemency the day of the execution. In Columbia, I'm Kiana Jordan. Watch Fox News, local first. To stay up to date with this story and more, make sure you subscribe to our Watch Fox YouTube page. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and click that notification bell so you never miss an update.